Hi, I'm Martin Ingram. I'm VP of Strategy with AppSense, and our discussion today is on Windows 7 and desktop virtualization, because Windows 7 is going to be a key driver for the adoption of desktop virtualization. The reality is that the majority of organizations haven't deployed Vista. For a number of reasons, people have chosen not to take Vista out to their broader user bases. And that's given people time to consider how they really want to deliver uh, operating systems and client computing in the future. And during that time, what people have found is that desktop virtualization has reached a point where it can now be deployed to the broader user base. Now, when's the event? What's the time when people are really going to do that? Well, actually, it just so happens that Windows 7 arrival gives us a good opportunity to go out to the user base and make those changes. Because as we've moved, once we've moved to desktop virtualization, then our subsequent operating system migrations are going to be far easier to do. And so the arrival of Windows 7 in the back end of 2009 is going to be a key trigger for organizations to start rolling out desktop virtualization across their entire user bases.